right, this is the uh, new version of my 3D printed mini ITX case. And this one's not going to be limited to Ryzen. You can do this on pretty much any mini ITX board because it is liquid cooled. That's right, liquid cooled mini ITX in a tiny little box. About as small as you could get. Um, maybe it looks a little goofy with the cooler sitting on top. You can print it in black and mix it all together. But uh, I don't think it's too bad. So let me pop it open. And as you can see, you have a Cooler Master Master Light 120 or Master Cool 120 Light. Same uh, Pico Power Supply. And uh, you can see it right there. That circuit board is sticking up. Pretty much the same exact setup as the uh, one with the AMD cooler. But here we have the Cooler Master. See the fan on the bottom? I'm using a Silent Wings fan. Trying to keep it as quiet as possible. And uh, it just mounts on through the top. There's uh, four mounting holes for the 120 fan and a pass through. So you can go, you can kind of see it through there. Oh, let me get in the light. You can see it passes straight through into the cooler. And the hose is just kind of bend around and fit in. And uh, that's about it, really. Other than that, it's the same exact setup, same memory. I don't have the screws in there, so it has a tendency to pop up on the same memory, same motherboard, same CPU, 2400G, AMD. Um, but because it's not limited to the AMD cooler, you should be able to fit, I uh, use this case for any mini iTech system, Intel, AMD, um, older, newer, whatever you can fit this cooler on. And this cooler is pretty, uh, pretty versatile, fits a lot of different things. And uh, you can get this really cheap. I picked this one up uh, a couple months ago for 29 bucks. I mean, a liquid cooler, 29 bucks, hard to beat. And a 120 like this is perfect for cooling an APU like that. I haven't seen temperatures go above, I don't know, 60 degrees. And that's uh, with benchmarking, playing Battlefield, everything. So it's pretty impressive for the price. And uh, it's actually cooler than trying to buy a, a Spire if you don't have a Spire. Like the uh, other version of the case. There's the, uh, the top, the old top with the Spire hole. So pretty much the same thing. And the, the, the bottom is the same. It's the same bottom for both of them. It's just the top that changes. So it kind of makes it versatile. You can go either way if you want. I'll post the files up on Thingiverse. Like I said, once again, it's really just the top, so I'll just add the top onto the other posting. And uh, you can go either way with that. And thanks for watching the video. Uh, if you have any comments or questions, just uh, shoot them to me down in the uh, comments. And uh, please subscribe if you want to see more. Thanks.